Regardless of the water care system you choose, there are tremendous benefits to maintaining a low level of calcium hardness in your spa water. When you remove the calcium hardness from your water, your spa water feels silky soft on your skin. You can also enjoy spa water that lasts longer, so you can go a longer amount of time between drain and refills. And by removing the calcium hardness from your spa water, you can help protect important hot tub components, like your jet pumps and heater, that can be damaged if scale buildup occurs. When you're using the ACE system, it's especially important to maintain your calcium hardness level between 25 and 75 parts per million. Keeping a low level of calcium hardness in the water will help you get the most life out of your ACE cell. Your fill water will fall into one of three buckets. You'll either have soft water, water of average calcium hardness, or water that has an especially high level of calcium hardness. If you're in the first bucket and you have soft water, congratulations, you don't need to do anything more to your water before filling your hot tub. If you have water of average calcium hardness, you'll need to use the Vanishing Act Calcium Remover to decrease your hardness and get into that okay range of between 25 and 75 parts per million. If you're in that third bucket and you have a calcium hardness level that is higher than 150 parts per million, we suggest you use the on-the-go portable water softener to fill your hot tub and for topping off. The on-the-go is a cost-effective and convenient way to ensure that you start your hot tub up with the best water possible and eliminate the likelihood of any problems occurring as a result of high levels of calcium hardness. Remember to test your water at startup and regularly to ensure that you're maintaining a calcium hardness level of between 25 and 75 parts per million. If you have any questions, refer to the quick reference guide or contact your hot spring dealer. Love.